This is Oscar Carmona from Healing Grounds Biodynamic Nursery located in Goleta, California. And I'd like to talk to you about tips for caring for your house plants. They're basically about four things that you need to consider for optimum health for plants indoors. Um, and those are basically water needs, the pot that you plant those in and the, and the soil that you're using, um, airflow and sunlight. Uh, making sure that you have sufficient sunlight is probably one of the critical factors uh, along with the temperature ranges that are maintained in the home environment uh, that are conducive to uh, good um, plant growth and that's generally in the areas of the upper 60s to low 80s uh, maintained um, throughout the day and in, in, into the night. Um, making sure that your plants are not uh, pushed up against a, a window or a wall so that there's proper air circulation around the plant can help the plant to breathe properly and, and also prevent uh, infestations such as whitefly, uh, mealybugs, and or aphids. Um, making sure that you have proper watering um, uh, schedules for your plants and it's not so much that you need to water every day but you need to water consistently um, and um, interestingly enough watering too much um, can exhibit the same sort of symptoms as um, not watering enough. Watering so that you see water flowing out of the container that the plants are in but not uh, having the plants sit in that water uh, on an ongoing basis. Sometimes you're going to need to poke your finger into the, into the potted um, soil mix to make sure that there is sufficient water uh, below the surface and it's not always evident by looking at the surface of the soil whether that is true. Um, the other thing is to feed your potted plants um, sufficiently I recommend fit the use of fish and kelp um, in a liquid form, and I call it the dynamic duo of uh, organic fertilizers. It's a very complete um, form of organic uh, fertilizers um, containing just about every uh, micro and macronutrient um, needed for health, plant health. This is Oscar Carmona, and I just provided you with some important tips for maintaining plants uh, in a healthy way indoors.